Before you are married, don't close your eyes onto one person. Once you're engaged, then you close your eyes. Done. Maybe Allah doesn't want you to marry the person because they are bad, horrible. Or maybe Allah doesn't want it because something might go wrong with the children the couple will have and you don't know. I'm not saying don't try. You try. You speak to your parents. You convince them. You can even change your wilaya if you want. You know what that means? This is my wali. He's my father. I will go to the panel of scholars and tell them my father is blocking my marriage without any reason. So I want to marry without my dad. And if you if you qualify for that, you can actually shift that wilaya to a wali will be someone else. Who will it be? That panel of scholars in an Islamic country, you'd have the Qadi or someone who would represent you as a wali. So they, the person becomes a wali of yours. So you need to be careful because sometimes if you do that and you know that the person you want to marry is not standing on their own two feet in terms of, you know, finances and so on, you might have to come back to your family one day and they might not want you at that stage.